Innovation Labs located at Port Kembla are our centre of excellence for flat products for Australia and for our global businesses. We have a long and proud history of innovation that have come out of these labs and they underpin the valuable brands that we have in the market today and that have been around for more than 50 years. Our mission is to continually create leading technology that adds value for our customers and the communities in which we participate. The way that we do that is by investing in our people, investing in our scientific equipment and investing with third party collaborators. Our innovation process is focused on meeting the needs of our customers. We use a customer-led design thinking approach to ensure we understand the desirability, the manufacturing and technical feasibility and the viability of each of our ideas. The Innovation Labs plays a key role in allowing us to quickly prototype and test our solutions both during the development process and as we move into full-scale production. We're very proud of what we do here. Please come and take a look at some of our team members and some of the centres of excellence. Uh, we've got uh, aluminium, zinc and various other materials that go together so that we use all of these materials and other metals to, to form alloys that drive our product development. What we have here is the uh, pot where we melt uh, different alloys to uh, be able to dip our metal substrate in. The servo drives the sample down into the pot. It gets dipped, stays there for a predetermined amount of time depending on which um, metal coating line we're trying to emulate. After the dip, we end up with something like this and this, where those two dips are different materials, different coatings. Construction these days is trying to fill houses with uh, more insulation, and with that insulation comes issues and challenges in managing condensation. So we're running tests in this hut under here to understand how to best install insulation so that we don't also build a condensation problem along the way to more energy efficient buildings. So come inside. So in here we have a simulation of a number of roof systems uh, with different setups of insulation that normally sits underneath the roof. And with this enclosure we can simulate a whole bunch of uh, moisture conditions that might come out of the house. So what we have here are the top surfaces of those roofs we looked at underneath. You can see that we're collecting temperature data and, and moisture data, condensation data. So this here is Passivation and Resin Lab. As a team here we look after our uh, coated substrates, uh, particularly zinc alum and uh, true core. So we're currently in the Weather Lab building and in this building we do testing on coated products through our QFOG machines, our, our corrosion machines and also through outdoor exposure sites. We're in the formability lab at the moment. We do a number of various different testing methods here. We have various forms of equipment here. On the table in front of you here at the moment is our um, some samples of plasterboard testing, which we're testing our sealants and adhesives. The passivation lab, where they've applied different um, coatings. Just try and simulate, again, what happens at our roll formers or our slitting lines. We receive the samples from the production lines. What we try and do is assess the paint thickness. We actually scribe, scratch a line on the paint and we take care not to damage the underlying metal coating. Now I'm going to focus in on the metal coated surface. Usually I'll go, oh, I work at the weathering lab and they go, oh, is that like the add-on TV with the guy out in the outdoor area? And I'm like, yep, that's exactly what I do. 